Hi, I'm David Yort and I want to showcase uh, a game that I made. It's named Miskatonic Tales and it's basically a game that it's uh, based on Lovecraft, Lovecraft myth uh, games like Elder Sign and others. <coughs> um, basically it's the typical narrative of one investigator that has to prevent one old one to conquer the, the earth uh, I create the, the setup uh, in this case we'll be facing Azathoth so we'll put the Doom Token, Doom token in the start position uh, we have to roll for initial enemies for this we'll roll two dice this two, for example, and we got two ones. So basically, if you see here in the map, there are those uh, numbers. This is where the initial enemies will appear, depending on the roll of the dice. I also will put the portals with the portal signs. And I'll put the player pawn here in the starting position. Uh, we don't need to close all the all the gates, depend on the difficulty level. In easy we need to close two gates, in normal three and in hard four gates. We have to choose also the, the initial well our <coughs> Our investigator, we ha we can choose between four of them. Uh, basically, each one has a different main stat. Jane has influence as the main stat. Mike has a strength. Lucy has a wisdom, and we have Regales, the detective, that it's the most balanced character. So we'll go for for it. He will start with one item of each kind. So we'll flip. We'll, we'll mark one initial item for him. Also, uh, we show that uh, Mike had three dice of each type for each stat. So we take away one of those dice. So we have three all of them <coughs> and we're gonna start the the game uh, the, the game goes in four different rounds there are three that are from the investigator so we have morning that we solve one of these uh, missions at the afternoon we solve one of these evening one of these missions and at night it will be the turn of Azathoth, the mythos turn when something bad will happen. Um, the objective is uh, to close those portals, so we need to move the pound in the direction of those portals. In order to move the, the pound, we need to solve missions that give us clues. Clues are this symbol, like a notebook. So this will be our main objectives. And when we are in a portal location, we need to use these missions here with a symbol, like an arcane symbol, uh, to close it. So we'll start. And the first thing that we have to do is, this happens in every of the investigation turns, we have to choose one of these two cars. Basically, we need to decide what we want to use here my impression is that this mission should be very affordable this it's a little more difficult it has uh, higher numbers to achieve so i think that we'll discard this card 
this will be the discard file and here we'll be discarding the the missions that we don't want to do and also the missions that we do after we complete them so <coughs> we decide to do this one of these three missions uh, we want to move so we need to do the second or the third one here we can do one thing that is scouting a scouting it's to well in order to fulfill a mission we need to roll all those nine dice and we'll need to <coughs> put these dice here in these slots in order to fulfill this but when we scout we can get three dice of the colors that we want in order to uh, foresee uh, how we'll face the challenge for example here we may want to have two strength dice and one wisdom dice in order to see or better let's get let's check these three of wisdom if we get a five then we'll go for this one but if we don't don't get a five probably we'll prefer to go for this one that seems slightly easier we'll roll we don't have any a straight five but we have a three and a two that can become a five so <coughs> i think it's worth it to try to do this mission uh, another thing important, we don't have to forget that we have two enemies already in the map. Um, those enemies uh, will need to be defeated during the investigations. Uh, we'll see. So, we'll roll this dice. And let's see if we can face this okay uh, in order to to fulfill the objectives we need here for example one the five as i said it can be done with a three and a two so we can go for it already this is five and now we need a 9 and a 1. The 9 it has to be an exact number. It cannot be more than 9. We need to combine dice in a way that it makes 9 exactly. And when we are combining dice, they have to be always of the same color. I can't combine one red and one green die in order to reach 9. But here we have five and four makes exactly nine but but we have a problem here that we need a one and we don't have any one here so in order to fulfill it we'll need to <coughs> use a, to use a, an item we have three different items that we can use the strength well, the, the, the weapons are used to reroll all dice of a single color and the money is used in order to add one or minus to a die result and the spell is used in order to reverse the face of a die so to convert a 5 to into a 2 here uh, the only thing that it work for us is to convert this 2 into a 1 using 1 money so that's what we'll do. Okay. That's a one. And we fulfill this mission. So we can move here. Okay. And also we gather two items. One money. So we recover the one that we lost and one weapon okay 
So I'll just start working well. The this card it's moved into the scar file, but we flip it. This it's done in order to get sure that in in the next day the the missions that it will be offered it will be different than the ones that we already did. But we have still a problem that is that we didn't fulfill yet any of those monsters. This is a problem because if or if we uh, have three monsters on the on the map and we need to deploy a fourth, then uh, we lose the game. So we should try at least to cover one of those guys. So we have here um, two missions. This seems relatively easy, but it, is, it asks for a seven already and we need to make sevens. This one um, could be easy to do, but the problem is that even if it gives us items, it doesn't allow us to move to the to the map. So I think and this seems too too difficult. So I think that we'll try to fo to focus into this mission. So we'll discuss this and we'll go for this. Let's do one thing. We have the 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 scope that it's a free action. <coughs> Let's do with these three dice in order to see. Okay, that seems good. We have one six here. Yeah, I think that we can go for this mission without any problem. <coughs> so nice, we got some high numbers. So what we have here, we need a seven. We have a seven here. We need a six, we have a six here. Ah, we need a one. We need a one. Hmm. But if we use this one, we won't be able to get this seven. And we need also more sevens. So I don't know, maybe we should try to use some reroll. Not the best thing to reroll should be this three dice. Because we have this three that can go here. We have this seven that can go here. We basically need another one. Nice, that's better. So we need this one, we have this one here, but we have a five and a two that we can add here. We have this three that goes here. And now what can we do? We can use one money. Mm, yeah. To convert these two into one. That gives us another seven. And this allows to take away one of those enemies. So what we got, we progress in the direction of the of the gate, and we got one spell. Okay. So more or less, we 
are advancing. This goes to the discard deck. Flip. Okay, now it's uh, evening. What we can do here? This is a risky thing that we can do. We can try to go for the puzzle box. Uh, the puzzle box uh, give us a clue and a symbol. That means that we could be able in the same turn to go into this location and also to close this portal. It's risky, but I think it's worth it to do. Uh, it's worth it to try at least. So, we don't have money, but it's very useful to to modify it as a result, but I think that we can manage. Uh, we can scope, so maybe we can try to check these two colors in order to see if we got these results or if it's worth it to go slower and then for this. In any case, we can discard this. And yeah, we'll use this. Three. We roll. It's a five. No, okay. So we have a four, a five. We don't have a six. This is not good. This is not good because I think it will be worth it to go for this. Oh yeah, this is this is too risky because we need to to get a six with this die or a one. Um so it's it's too risky because if we don't get any of these two values well maybe if we get that two we can combine but there are too many chances that this goes bad. We'll go to to this mission. So we'll roll the other six dice. Okay. Let's see. Okay, we have a three here on the strength. We have a five here. Okay. Not bad. We have here five, six, six, five. Hmm. Well, getting the four, it's easy. We have this four here. Getting the eight plus, it's also easy. We can get either this or this. But I'm thinking that we have here this enemy. We can do something to eliminate it. We can use one spell maybe. If we can find a way to convert any of this into seven, for example, to use the spell to revert this six. So we spend this spell here, we change this for a one. We have seven. We can take this and we can still use these two red dice in order to get eight or more. So with this, okay, we advance. We, ah, we don't claim yet the, sorry, but uh, we take out this enemy. Okay. So I think it is still good. And we get also as reward one of this money. And we finish. This is the first day. We have Athatoth. 
and this nice guy uh, each night move doom tracker once that means that the doom tracker goes here and minus one weapon that means that we have one weapon less okay um, a spawn an enemy in player location so there will be an enemy here this means the enemy will need to be defeated with a six on influence but now it came the pain roll a dice uh, of each color if the result of any die is one that die is locked until next night this is the risky part We need to not get anyone here, and we don't have anyone, so it's okay. We've been lucky. Uh, now we deploy this. There is one thing with the with the tabletop simulator trying to shuffle this uh, because there are cars that are normal and cars that are flipped. It will make a mess. So basically, I'll get this card and I'll put them in semi random. There is this another here or here. Okay. We have to pay attention into, into this. There are basically all the cards, they have the symbol only in one of the sides. So we have to be very careful if we are going, we are doing missions on the sites that they have a symbol, in the next day we won't have symbols because those cards will be flipped. So well, this is the second day and the first thing that we need to do is to close this portal. So I have only one choice, that is to go for a sacrifice in blood. 9 or plus on strength and few minor dice that should be easy I can discard this and well if we get a uh, 6 in influence it will be also awesome so let's try to uh, draw I'm not forgetting anything okay, I don't think so I didn't do the, the scout, but it was not necessary because we were aiming simply for this mission. Okay, what we have here? We can have nine or more. Exactly nine, so this is good. Uh, we have a six here in... Ah, but we'll be needing it for the mission, probably. Mm. Well, let's see. Uh, my question is, it should be worthy maybe to reroll? I don't think so. Well, uh, we have here a three, we have another three here, we have four, we have a six here. What we don't have is the five. but we have a three we can use money or a spells um, money to convert it into one into four or a spell to make the reverse of three in that it's also four mm. checking what we'll have in the next mission will be probably uh, I think there's a madam hmm. I think that I'll use money because um, here we'll reduce uh, a spell soon and I don't want to reach that spot without the spells because if you don't have uh, an item you have zero units of an item but the item need to be subtracted 
and the die of the same color it will be locked so that will mean that if I don't have any spell and the doom tracker enters here I will have the one of the uh, dice of the blue dice lock and I don't want that so I'll go for the money and I will convert this three into four and well I think I because it's a five so it was wrong all time long I cannot do this the only solution is to use the the spell to change this two into a five so this rotation to five okay this is completed I get two weapons and I close the portal we can put the portal tokens here and as soon as we have three if we're playing on normal we can go to the ritual uh, to the ritual side to try to break the ritual <coughs> okay this card goes here flip it now as I commented I don't want to use this card because I want the I don't want to flip it for the next round I want to have more symbol based cards so I'll go for here I want to advance so I can only choose these two options mm, I think I'll go for this option that gives me an, an spell that's it, that is what I need but in any case I think that I can roll I can scout using these three dice in order to get sure that I can reach nine or more here yeah it's not a problem and I also have four here so yeah we'll go for this this mission can go this let's roll and what we have here well we have the the nine this is the first thing that we need I I think that I should roll this because this is not useful for me at all do I know I have this four that can go here we have a five that can go here mm, I think that it will be worth it to spend one weapon in order to roll these three dice I think this is better this is not also what I wanted I expected to be able to to have this six here mm, I still can do it spending one money okay let's see uh, the four goes here the five goes here here we can put the four and the two um, I think it hmm. yep I'll use this in order to convert one of these five into a six and doing this I can fulfill this so this becomes a six and I take away this 
why I'm doing this? The when we finish this this day at night, there will be two new enemies. One enemy it will be the one that that found each night, but also the doom token it will move into this portal. So that means that another enemy will spawn this in one of the portals. So we better be safe. Even if I'm without money again. And okay. I can sh Okay. Uh, I also move here. Oh, I can move either here or here. I think I move here. This is easier to fulfill than eight. Um, I have to fulfill one of these two. I don't have money, so that will be ideal. Mm, I think that I'll get this card, I'll discard this. And between this card, any of those two works for me. I think that the best approach it will be to scout and check the the influence because this will show me if I can get this or I can get this. <laughs> it seems that I will be without money because mm, clearly it worked better this than this because I don't have any three I don't even have a direct way to get it because to convert well I could use a spell but I don't really want to use a spell I think it's better to go for this we'll contact with a former cultist and let's check the clue that this guy will give us. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Also, if I wanted to do the pre the first mission, I didn't got also in any five. So it's a lag that we chose this other mission. Okay, the first thing it will be the eight or plus. Okay, we have two, we have six. Oh, we, ha we don't have five. We don't have five. We don't have five, and also I cannot convert the two because I need that two. I need the three, I need this two, I don't have a five. I can risk to roll this and try to get a five and try to get a five and, and a six, but I may lose the weapon and not get any of all. So I should pass or I should try. Okay, let's try. Uh, to go well, I need a six and a five here. Mm. Well, I got a five. Mm. 
I didn't got a 6, but I got a 1 that I can use a spell to convert it into 6. This is better than lose this. So, okay, I got the spell back. I got the, the clue in order to move here. Uh, well, I completed the mission. Everything right now it's kind of okay. I mean, I just let's see how it works this night. Okay, in this night I need to. The first thing is to spawn. Uh, well, to move the track, the Doom Tracker once. Okay, and I get uh, one enemy in the closest portal, that is where I am. But also I get another enemy in the same spot where I am. Okay. There is too much people here. Okay. And aside of this... I have to check if I am losing any of the dice. But it's not the moment to lose any of the dice now. Well, I won't lose any of the dice. Ah, that's something. Okay, uh, let's... Well, the good part is that I have two cards to choose. This seems more complicated because it's a, it's a, um, a symbol but also a clue. Probably I'll go for this. Take into account that I need also to try to defeat any of these enemies and I don't have too many items. So, okay, I'm... I'll discard this and then go for this. I won't scout because my only choice is to do the second mission. Who sent this mysterious package? Okay, let's check. Hmm. Okay, what we have here? A five, lots of five. A five and a four, it will give us the needed influence. We have a four here and a five and a one. So we have plenty of dice here that we can use to kill one of the enemies. So if I'm not mistaken, eight. And this is nine, but it's more than eight. We have this five, we have this one, we have this four, and now we make one and six plus. So here we make the six, here we make the one, and one of these enemies is out. Hmm, this is a very good mission. I mean, it gives me two resources. Also, this. We are doing very well. Okay, these missions go here, flip it. And uh, now we need to move into this. I may try something a little risky that it's to go for this, the secret passage. 
that will allow me to move twice but it has a lot of requirements on colors and I still have one enemy that I should try to to kill but I think well another option also it's to scout so let's get this let's scout and see if, if I get one or two of these symbols then maybe I can risk to go for this uh, but if I get a three here definitely I will go for this one but it's not a bad option because it gives me two items okay I have the five I have the six we'll go for the top one and obviously the other dice were not so good well the five goes here the six goes here we need a four here that we can get with money we need a exact seven a, a, a exact nine that we cannot get it in any way we can get because if I convert this into four I will lose the last of the money so I cannot convert this into three to get nine and also I won't have also the six so here I think that we aimed to the moon and we lost So what we have to do now is to minimize the losses. I think that the way to minimize the losses it will be hmm. well we may try to resolve this. I mean it cannot be worse than it's right now. to resolve hmm. better so we have this we still we still have the problem of the of the nine in order to get it we'll need to use the money that we have to convert this but we have the six or more. Hmm. Yep. Well, something. So we lose money. We convert this into three. We make nine. We use this to get six plus. So we move twice, but at a high cost. And I think that maybe it wasn't worthy because now we have here, yeah, here I think knife because here the only symbol it already has a clue. So I could have aimed for this that it will have granted me uh, two items instead of losing two items and still fulfilling this that I need to fulfill it anyway if I want to get the symbol I could have moved and then used the symbol so here I made a huge mistake 
okay so now I have to face this and I'm facing it without items I also I have two spells but I need to save one so well, this no needed Let's go and and okay. I can use one spell to convert this four into a three. This is the only thing that I could do to save this, and then I think that the others. The no, I don't have any five either. <coughs> I don't have any five either. I I miss it. have to use one only to minimize the the damage because for each uh, a slot that I'm not filling I will be uh, receiving one damage and <laughs> we're having this lock now now this will be a nightmare now this will be a nightmare because we we'll put this here, we we'll put this here, and where is not really? No, I have this. No, maybe I still the four and the two make this. No, I should need a <coughs> one moment. I could need the reverse of this yeah I can work with that okay uh, I'll, I'll spend the, the last spell even if I know that I will be needing one in order to convert this into these two into a five I'll put this five here now this is six plus but it's four and four so I fulfill the mission at least that allowed me to get this okay but <laughs> let's see what happened now okay it's night it's not so bad to use resources okay uh, move doom tracker once move to here and uh, I need to pay one one spell book that I don't have so one of the dice goes here it will be only uh, during one investigation so it's not so huge deal an enemy will appear here okay and now I have to do the three dice. Um, okay, I didn't lose any of the dice. Well, I've been quite lucky because I throw three times the three dice and I didn't get a, any one. So I can go back to. Okay. It goes quite 
quite well right now but I need to focus into not getting any damage if I get any damage I will need to pay more items that it will lock me more so uh, I need to move forward probably the best choice it will be this because I will be needing money, so probably this will be the next the best option. I'll discard this. Let's uh, scout. I mean, the good part is that neither this or this ask for wisdom, that I only have two dice. So I can do this. Let's uh, scout. Oh, oh, then this is bad. I don't have any item, and I don't think I'm prepared to fulfill neither this or this. Well, I should have selected this. It's like this. Sorry. So, what I can do? Okay. This okay, this uh, but no, 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 I can have the three, but I can't have four in any way. So, okay, now it will, and let's check if at least I can kill any of the enemies, no, I cannot kill any of the enemies, neither. So, I cannot fulfill this, but not only this, I miss this. I need to pay money and I don't have money I'll have this dice lock ok let's try now maybe I should try to stop and make a recap of items trying to fulfill this mission this mission this mission it's a little difficult because it's it has two ones that are difficult to catch but this also it's difficult also if I fail I need one weapon and maybe I should go for this or this okay let's try to go for an unknown benefactor and um, what I'll do first is to scout before deciding if I go for this mission or this mission and I'll uh, scout the three ok so definitively no I'm not going for an unknown benefactor I, I'm not going for a blue stream in the back alley, I have to go for an unknown benefactor. Okay, so I have to roll the other dice. Um, and this is bad. I don't have any way to get. I can have a oops. I can have a five. I can have a, a one. I can have. 
of uh, two. Or maybe I can have a four. I can have a two. but I can have an 8. So I won't be getting any on, of this. I'll get this. And uh, sorry, this needed to be here. I uh, need this flip it. I recovering this but I'm losing this because I don't have any weapon to pay and the problem is that I'm probably dead already <coughs> we, we were going so well but I think that I might be dead already I the next Doom tracker, it will be here. So it will spawn one enemy. So if I don't defeat at least one enemy, that means two enemies. So I'm dead. But I don't have any any item. Probably the best choice it should be this in order to get a lot of items. But I need to kill one of those enemies and they ask me for once so there is no good choices here the problem is that if you let the items to go down I mean I tried to go very very fast and that um, depleted my items and when my items were depleted then it's very difficult to recover So, I think the best choice it will be this. It's not tight, no. This. I mean, this requires me strength and I only have two dice. This is too difficult. These ask me for higher values. Yeah, probably this. Yeah, I'll go for this and I'll pray for having very high numbers. I don't even ask out. Let's try. Well, I have high numbers. This is something. <laughs> I have a 5 plus. Okay. That's nice. Ah, uh, but uh, I'm, al I'm already dead. I don't have any one, so I cannot kill any of the enemies. And I cannot kill any of the enemies. And the problem is that I cannot change the, any of the dice. So no matter if I fail or not, well, I can at least complete it in order to at least finish this okay a four here a eight here oh, so we have a lot of dice remaining so hooray and I get this but now in the mythos phase Doom Tracker at but once, so a new enemy appear, and I have to spawn an enemy in the location of the player. It's not possible, I died. And the world ends. Sorry, guys, I mean, it was close, and well, I could move one position, I mean, because I completed the, the 
the mission so I only needed to move two more and then uh, get the symbol and I could have one but it couldn't be and that's all uh, one hour of gameplay more or less so it's I hope that you enjoyed that thank you